everybody today i'm going to be trying out digital block art so i've seen some really pretty pictures of people doing this and it looks so cool so i wanted to give it a try my ipad and apple pen make sure to hit that subscribe button and now let's just get right into the video so i've got a cute picture of a beagle here this is not my picture by the way so i feel like we got to start somewhere so maybe hmm i guess we could just start with like the face uh, so I've seen that a lot of them don't have eyes, like they kind of just take them out. And they're also not supposed to do like a lot of shading. So I'm just trying to stick with that. Okay, so we got the ears done. Uh, we can do more of its face. Or do we need like a lighter color for the face? I don't know, maybe we'll do that so that it's like different from ears. That's pretty good. Um, the nose, I feel like we just like fill in, right? Now, how do I do this mouth area? That's like kind of tricky because there's like a bunch of different colors here. Maybe we just kind of go for like gray. I don't know, we can see how this looks and change it if I don't like it. Yeah, no. Maybe we can just do like a little bit like that. And then we can kind of just go over white for the rest of it. It's not really staying true to the picture, but no one said we had to. <laughs> okay, so I fixed it up again, made the edges a little bit smoother, and now it's time to work on the body. So I'm just starting out with the neck here. We've got to avoid this collar. I guess we can just do the dark brown here. There's a bit more on this side. I'm trying to stay consistent with the colors and not change it for each splotch on the dog's body. I guess I'll do this whole back part right now because it is that color and just knock it out. I'm gonna go back with the orangey brown color and fill in this little section here. Here I'm doing the back leg. And a reason I chose the beagle is because it has so many colors uh, so that it's not like I'm focusing on just like one area that's one color and then I have to like make that into different sections with different like shades of that color. Whereas this is kind of like, it's just that color, if that makes any sense at all. <laughs> but here I'm going over the white and this is kind of hard to see because the background is snow, but I will be changing that when we get rid of the photo from under this. Now are all the little details like the collar and the paws. So I'm just going to let you enjoy me doing those. So I just finished tracing him and now it's time to take away the background. So here we go. And so for the background, I was thinking maybe like a green. Like I think about there might be a good color, so let's try it. I like it. And now that it's all done, here's how it turned out. So yeah, this is how it turned out. I'm so happy with it. I think it looks really, really good, especially for my first time. And probably one of my favorite digital drawings ever. So yeah, hope you enjoyed. Bye!